Ladbrokes is rated A by SBR. Click on their logo to learn more. Hi, I'm Natalie Rydstrom and welcome to World Sports Weekly. Defending World Cup champions, Spain look to repeat their historic 2010 finals. However, they are not top favourites to do so, which adds potential betting value. Here with me now to discuss their chances a few weeks out from the World Cup kickoff is Alex Peace from Vassagol.com. Alex, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. Now, Spain have good reasons for entering the World Cup with a chip on their shoulder. Uh, they're not the first or even the second team uh, on the tips of many sports writers' tongues as far as repeating as champions. Do you think this makes for a good bulletin board material or a source of motivation for Spain? I think it does. I think you look back two years ago when they won Euro 2012. People weren't sure of them either. They didn't take a striker. They didn't play a striker a lot of time. People still thought, well, they're not going to score enough goals to win it. And they went on to win it quite comfortably in the end, being um, Italy 4-0 in the final. So I think Spain, I think they quite like being the underdog. I think they like that they're going to go under the radar a little bit. It's still very much the same nucleus of the squad that won the last few, the two Euros and the World Cup. You know, Iniesta, Zabi, they're all still there. So they're going to come here and they'll go about their business. So I think they, I think they will like being the underdog. Mm. Their odds have improved a bit from the bookies. Our last video update had them priced at 8 at Bet365 to win outright. These odds have lowered to 7.5. Does this number have value to you? I think it still does. I think you can't forget that they've won the last two European Championships and the last World Cup. Maybe the players are aging a little bit now. They're not quite as good as they once were. They're still a great team. There's some great players in there. And, you know, um, got a striker in Diego Costa who turned down his native Brazil to play for Spain. He could be massive. I mean, if he can get him scoring, get the balls into him, they could, have, they could go all the way. OK, do you have any betting markets involving Spain that stand out to you as having value at this time? Yeah, I think the one I found is you've got to expect to at least make the last four. And then and Spain to make the semi-finals, that's 13 to 8 with Bet365. That's a really big prize for a team that have, that have won the last World Cup and won the last two European Championships. So 13 to 8 to make the semi-finals for Spain is a good bet for me. OK, nice. So Spain ending up in the top four here. Alex Pieces from That's a Goal .com. You can find the link in the description below this video. They provide free football betting tips and the latest bookmaker offers for all major football leagues, including the World Cup. Do be sure to check it out. Alex, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me.